Amber Lee Lancaster, born September 19, 1980, is an American model, actress, and interior designer. She is best known for playing Jenny Swanson on MTV's The Hard Times of R.G. Berger, as well as being a model on The Price is Right. Lancaster was born in Tacoma, Washington. She attended Franklin Pierce High School in Tacoma. In 1998, she won the title of Miss Washington Teen USA. She went on to join the Seagulls, the cheerleading squad of the Seattle Seahawks football team. Lancaster was a member of the Seagulls for five seasons before moving to Los Angeles to pursue her dancing and modeling career. In 2003, Lancaster was a regular dancer on the syndicated dance show Soul Train, where she enjoyed a three-year stint until leaving in 2006. Lancaster appeared in the music video for Bo Bice's song, The Real Thing. In 2007, she made an appearance at the 2007 Scream Awards Citation Needed. In 2008, Lancaster joined the cast of The Price, is right as one of the show's models. In 2009, she was a trophy holder at the 61st Primetime Emmy Awards. Lancaster also appeared in the MTV comedy series, The Hard Times of R.G. Berger as Jenny Swanson III. Lancaster owns her own interior design business, Lancaster Interiors. On October 7, 2017, Lancaster married businessman A.J. Alodi in Palm Springs, California. In April 2019, Lancaster announced she and Alodi were expecting their first child in October 2019. 6. Lancaster developed preeclampsia during her pregnancy, which resulted in their son, Russ, being born two months early on August 3, 2019. 7. In late August, Lancaster revealed she underwent a partial hysterectomy, the removal of her uterus, as a result of complications during the birth. 8. In September 2020, Lancaster announced her separation from Alodi. In November 2021, Amber launched a clothing line with Vissy Collection. Amber Lancaster has seen her fair share of difficulties over the past few years, despite having quite a successful career. The TV celebrity got married, got divorced, had kids, and almost died. But despite ongoing hardship, she has created an encouraging online network and discovered a new love. Amber Lancaster, a resident of Washington, took her first breath on September 19, 1980, in Tacoma. When she began hosting free talent events in her community at age six, her passion for dance and performing was born. Lancaster also went to nursing facilities to meet people and share her skills. She kept up her love of dancing and joined the Seagulls, the cheerleaders for the NFL's Seattle Seahawks. Uncertain when, she relocated to Los Angeles to focus solely on her entertainment career. She performed professionally on the music talk show Soul Train between 2003 and 2006. In order to increase her on-screen presence, Lancaster landed smaller roles in a number of movies and TV shows, such as Red Line, CSI, Miami, Entourage, in which she starred alongside Matt Dillon's brother Kevin Dillon, Community, a comedy series starring Ken Jeong and Donald Glover, and My Own Worst Enemy, in which Taylor Lautner co-starred. She gained widespread recognition for her 2010-2011 performance as Jenny Swanson, the primary character's love interest in The Hard Times of R.G. Berger. In 2008, the former Miss Washington Teen USA winner signed on as a model for the CBS game show The Price is Right. Additionally, Lancaster fostered her personal life while simultaneously enjoying the results of her labor. In 2017, she was married to a businessman, and the two then established a family. Their marriage ended in divorce, however, Lancaster has not officially said when it occurred. Amber Lancaster formally announced her divorce. In a late 2022 TikTok video, Lancaster provided some insight into how she handled inquiries about her well-being following her divorce. A wine-filled glass was in her hand as she stood in her kitchen for eight seconds while lip-sensing the lines. This is just an update.
I'm sad, but thin and attractive, so that helps. Sick, she shrugged as she ended the video. This Valentine's Day, she wrote in a more somber tone that her life had turned upside down and was nearly ripped from her. In her essay, she wrote, I felt like I had lost everything and wasn't sure if I could ever pull myself out of that black hole. Despite the fact that Lancaster didn't identify the terrible incident, and it's unclear when her divorce took place, it's possible that she was referring to her divorce from her ex-husband. His latest appearance on her Instagram timeline was in a picture from December 19, 2019. She continued her article in Reflection, describing the decline in her mental health during that period, but adding that she had survived heartbreak. Since then, she has been thriving, despite a few occasional difficult days. Alodi, AJ was Amber Lancaster's husband, and the two of them had a son. Director of sales at Panascape since December 2019, AJ Alodi holds this post. He had previously spent a year working in Hofseth North America's Biocare Sales Department. Between 2013 to 2018, Alodi served as Philomedia, Incorporated's Director of West Coast Sales. The Miami University alumnus worked as a partner and account executive at Figuan, brand studio from January 2010 and November 2012. Although the beginning of his and Lancaster's relationship is uncertain, they wed in Palm Springs in 2017. With the people we adore the most, it was the most amazing day. Nothing more could have been provided for us, people were informed at the time. Even as part of her vows, Lancaster had read a journal post about Alodi. Two months ahead of schedule, the couple welcomed their son Russell Levi into the world in August 2019. Her kid was placed in the neonatal intensive care unit, NICU, and she was placed in the intensive care unit, making it a painful delivery for Lancaster, ICU. A week after his birth, while she was recovering from surgery, Lancaster finally got to hold her child. The single mother pays yearly tribute on her social media platforms to both the birth of her baby and her survival. Russell, whose images and videos take up the most of his father's Instagram page, is co-parented by her and Alodi after their divorce. When it's your ex's night with your kid, Lancaster once made fun of her co-parenting arrangement in a TikTok video. She takes a sip of wine while singing along to the song in the video, You'll Do. Be well-liked, you'll become well-liked. Brandon Lancaster parenting, blogging, activism, and many other aspects of post-divorce life. Like Alodi, Lancaster spends a lot of time with her son, but she has also broadened her professional interests. She started a business in addition to posting on Instagram and TikTok. The Broken Hearts Club is an internet store owned by Lancaster. Her products are mostly clothes, including t-shirts, caps, and hoodies for kids and adults. She received an invitation to speak in favor of Bowie's Law in the California State Capitol last month. Animal shelters are required by law to provide prospective adopters 72 hours notice before euthanizing animals. The vote was unanimous, for Lancaster, saving and defending the lives of animals has always been a passion, so taking this action was satisfying. She informed her fans of the accomplishment and said that while Bowie's law will protect animals, it was just the beginning. In May 2023, Amber Lancaster's new boyfriend will be announced. Lancaster recently shared a photo of her new boyfriend on Instagram. The actress posted a video montage of her and her beau having fun together at the Stagecoach Festival, with country singer Chris Stapleton singing Starting Again in the background. Although Lancaster's fans are overjoyed, they don't yet know who her new boyfriend is. Thanks for watching my video.